Hello, Emmanuel. Welcome to the stream. Welcome, everybody. <laughs> Hope you all had a fantastic Friday. And you're ready for some more trucking. I am. Hey, Brett. How's it going? Did I? Oh, G. Faviano. <laughs> Oh, it wasn't bad. I got to drive a big rig again for once. So that was nice. Even though my shifting skills went somewhere into the basement. Although, to be fair, I also wore big my big work boots, but uh, which I never usually wear when I drive a truck. Like I usually, I'm one of those truck drivers, or I was one of those truck drivers when I was still driving full time, that uh, would wear his boots outside and then take them off. And inside, I would have like, well, just like slippers or kind of moccasins, if you will. Um, but yeah what a job market holds for us i don't think much but uh, ice cream to evanston i don't mind drive safe thanks hey zippy zippity doo die zippity day doo -doo 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 -doo. hello josh how's it going Was close. Right. Oh, thank you so much. Are you already on your way to Japan? And welcome back to the stream family. Keep right and then turn right. Hello, Pramil uh, Pramila. From Nepal, turn wow. Right. Dude, that's a ways. Oh, lovely. Hey, BTT. How's it going? straight 
Mm, Cascadia better or Volvo? I don't know. Between Cascadia and the Volvo, there's really not much difference. Hey, JW. Oh, what? The US have... Uh, but it's for you guys Labor Day too? I had no idea. Hello Paul, welcome. straight on so the puppy is here oh dang it go straight on they say JP I am 90% sure you are in the wrong stream Turn left. The puppy is sleeping. Keep right and then turn right. I have no idea. Turn right. It's Get funny though. Turn left. Yeah, Peter and Onesie is turn left. used to its new surroundings and everything, then you most likely will. Um, he was mildly interested, Get ready to turn left. but he was more interested in sleep. Turn left. <laughs> Pat, that's funny. Here we are, safe and sound. Yeah, JP, it's, uh, as I said before, and I say that gr uh, gladly again, I don't know Wyoming from a hole in the ground. So, I just like how it looks. Now, whether it, it looks like it should look, uh, no, nor do I care really, to be honest with you. Well, well I do care, but I, I just, I can't be the judge of that. But for my personal opinion, I like the look of it. Hello, Chris. Happy uh, Friday. Sound like an airline pilot. Uh, welcome uh, on board of uh, Air Canada 913. Our flight today is from uh, Edmonton. Two Patricks. Oh, that can be good. We don't discuss what? What are we not discussing? Dang it. 
I can't back up anymore, I can't shift anymore. It's a good thing I don't drive trucks in real life. Ha oh, oh, ha oh. ha. Yeah, tomorrow is going to be a long day for you. How long is the flight to... Uh, where, where are you going in? Tokyo or no? Uh, zippy, it should be, yeah. Oh, man. Ele well, 11 hours is not so bad, though. So we are going to load ice cream. Yummy, yummy ice cream. Hmm. Hello, Raspy TV Supreme. Welcome. Let's do this. So, Brett, what do you think of our? What do you think of our? Uh, Dr. Hinshaw. Oh, you like those long trips, don't you? Turn right. right hello king crazy you welcome to the street international lt get ready to turn right Turn right. Oh, nice. So you can fly business class. Go straight on. Hey, John. Welcome to the stream. Happy Friday, my friend. SF Giants, how you doing? Go straight on. Yeah, been better, but certainly been worse, Peter. 
Oh, nice. That is a happy Friday then. Go straight on. Wonderful. And life in general is good, I hope. Keep left and then turn left. Oh, nice ball. Well, that's, that works then. Turn left. What do you think I'm doing here? Yeah, I've seen pressure cookers go off in the past. It is no fun. I mean, I have, well, I, I seen them also being used for years without accident. If you use them the right way and you follow all the recommendations, right. then they and are an amazing right. tool to get food cooked quickly. Turn right. Hey, Lewis. Thank you, thank you. Have a wonderful night. I will tell you one thing. The sound of the turn signal in a Western star is freaking atrocious. And if you watch the video that I uploaded today, then you probably will agree with me. Bye, Zippy. Have a good one. Well, I mean, technically it is a pressure vessel. I love it. I have no idea if it looks anywhere close to the real deal because I've never been. In Keep Wyoming. Left, and then exit left. But, uh, I exit really left. do like the way that it's all, yeah, the, the, it, it's, it's an SES DLC, so what can I say? It's beautiful. It's beautifully made. It's nicely composed. It, the... I mean, you know how SES gets better with every, um, with every DLC, and this one is no exception, really. Well, Paul, then count yourself lucky. 
I'd say. Hello, puppy. Oh, welcome to the stream. Well, still better than a natural gas explosion, but you know what? I don't know if you've seen the pictures from those houses in New Jersey that were flooded and then burned down. Like, that is adding insult to injury. I bet you... No, Gus, unfortunately it did not. Yeah, I was just thinking though, I bet you that good woman had a quick bowel movement when that thing exploded. Hey monkey. Many sharks, I am recording tomorrow for next week, yes. Yeah, I seen the New York subway flooding. Yep. And that bus too that was flooded. Man, that was some crazy. Yeah, so far it's it's really nice. There is no two ways about it. I I do enjoy it. to the stream. Oh, what's going on here? 70? Oh, uh, well, we have gone 60. Oh, it's 60. Poplar Street. We have a Poplar Street, too. Also, right, and then exit right. Oh, it's your it's, uh, birthday weekend, so is today your birthday? Exit right. Keep right, and then turn right. Turn right. Left. 
Sunday. Oh, okay. Hey, KC. How's it going? Yeah. Hello, King. Welcome to the stream. Hello, George. Go straight on. How are you? You know what? Honestly, nobody cares about that at the moment. Right? How's it going? Keep right and then turn right. Turn right. Yes, Pat, I agree. Let's talk about the games that I'm playing. Or anything else, but... Oh, so they didn't have signs up? That's unfortunate. Cut off by a fire truck. You don't have that off. Yeah, I'm driving an LT. No, Pat, I think that is the white flag. It's the last round. Keep right and then continue straight on. Go straight on. Or the last lap, I should say.
Okay, so to put this in simple words, before you watched the stream, you were driving to a hotel, did not follow the speed on. limit, and got a ticket. Is that a correct summary? Oh, LT28. I love the LTs. Oh, good, Ray. How about yourself? See, now we got to the bottom of that. I don't know, BTT. I, I can get behind it. I think it was just the way he said it was a little bit backwards. Go straight on. straight on I mean 10 over that sounds realistic to me that's not like somebody telling us that he just crashed his car and is now in the ICU and is watching the stream on his ECG monitor I mean, George, to be fair, you can just turn it off. You don't have to throw it out of the window. So what do you guys think about Elon Musk's latest response? I laughed so hard. Unfortunately, I was drinking coffee when I read it. And I almost was wearing said coffee. when that one guy asked him so how does that work regulatory when you use satellites without a downlink station in a different uh, country <laughs> and, and and Elon uh, Elon uh, answers well they can shake their fists at the sky keep right <laughs> That's awesome. the man is amazing Oh look, Rollins discovered. Funny. <laughs> I just imagined a bunch of Taliban standing there. And then turn right. Turn right. Go straight on. I 
I'm not so sure what I think about the sound of this truck, to be honest. I mean, it's not terrible, terrible, but it lacks a certain... Yeah, I don't know. Depth, if you will. Go straight on. It just seems flat. Well, but maybe it's my headphones too. I don't know. I don't know how it sounds for you guys. Yeah, it's the new international. Go straight on. Hello, Cameron. Keep How's right. it going? Welcome to the stream. Yeah, I think I'm gonna be buying something different too, but the problem is... The, the, the major problem with that proposition is that... With all that showcasing that I did lately... My account is pretty much drained and I'm still paying off a $400,000 debt in-game, so... Yeah, it's gonna be a hot minute before I'm going to be able to buy something new. I will say this much though, um, the fuel consumption of this truck is amazing.
Or also, uh, Dre, what you could do is put it on a cooling pad. Oh, it was totally my fault. I misread an email. I missed one significant step. No, a cooling pad, not not a CPU cooler, a cooling pad. For laptops. Keep left. Seems like a long night, eh? Keep left. No, a cooling pad or a cooler pad is uh, basically, it looks like a little triangular platform where you put your laptop on top and you have two big fans in that platform and that significantly increases the performance before you have heat throttling. Because that's what I did with my, uh, with my old Hewlett Packard. It tended, like, keep in mind that was when I was still dr uh, driving truck, when I had this thing mainly. And having it sitting on my bed, it o always, always overheated. And uh, so I got those cooling pads and, yeah, it never overheated again. Hello, Tyler. How's it going? Bill. I'm doing excellent, thanks for asking. How about yourself? I'm doing well. Not not really excited of the prospect of having to wear a mask in the office, but Oh well. No. No, absolutely not.
But you know what I was saying to my wife earlier? You know, the, the way that the government worded it from the beginning kind of made me wonder from the first from from the first time I heard it. You know, this whole thing open for uh, open for summer. Just the way that was worded back then made me wonder from the beginning. Get ready to turn right. So it's not like we kinda didn't know him before what was coming. Turn right. Keep left, and then turn left. That's the plan. Turn left. Come on, green light. Come on, green light. Come on, green... Uh. Yeah, no kidding, hey? No kidding, Paul. Salt Lake. Yeah, well, I can tell you one thing. I'm not gonna do that whole nonsense again. They can just go away. I got my vaccine once, and I got the booster shot, and that's it. I was not happy about this whole thing in the first place, because it was way too rushed. Now that? No. Nah. No, thank you. Keep left. And then turn left. Turn left. And I can guarantee... I don't know how it is for you guys down there. But I can guarantee you that if they try that up here then they're gonna have problems on their hands because people are already losing their cool with this whole thing. And to be honest with you, I don't blame them. Keep left and then turn left. Turn left. Turn right. Finally, we are here. Wallbird looks more and more like Walmart, doesn't it? Um, we are in... Oh, somewhere in my own... I have no idea.
Wow, Tyler, I think they're gonna have... Then there's gonna be problems. Big problems. Like you can, you, I, I said that many times, you can kick old dogs only so many times before said dog turns around and bites your foot off. And it's coming. You know that backup beeper reminds me so much of the turn signal sound in that uh, Western Star that I was driving today. Ugh, so annoying. Well, you know what? I mean... I'm a strong believer in personal freedom. I would like to know how a server in a restaurant will react if I ask him if he has hepatitis A, B, C uh meningitis or whatnot and if they say no then i would like to see that twin rex twin rex Flame, you know how much I care if I offend somebody? I care about as much as when in China a bicycle tips over. That's how much that concerns me if I offend somebody. Look at that, we have only one little town left here. Hmm. Two little towns. Oh, dynamite to Sheridan. That sounds good to me. Let's do that. Okay, here we go. I like dynamite. Sea flame to that whole offending somebody thing. You have no idea how many things I I could say that offend me that I see every day. But uh, you will never hear me complain because offense is taken and not given.
Okay, let's find a new route. What's happening? Oh. Be right back, guys. Sorry, friends. But I had a chance to pet the puppy, so obviously. Hey, Zeno, welcome to the stream. Um, let me grab a coffee real quick before we head out. Because right now my coffee is still warm, or my coffee maker is still on. Once it turns off, the coffee gets cold, so I'm about to pick.
All right. Uh, coffee. Hey, Michael. Welcome to the stream. Turn left. So many new members. So nice to see. Who knows? Maybe sometime eventually. Oh, nice, John. Now, you know, this to, to bring my thought on this whole situation to an end, especially with that offending, people need to grow the frick up. It doesn't hurt them when Get they are ready, offended. Right. Nothing happens when you are offended. It's not like you wake turn up, right. you were offended, and the next morning you wake up and have leprosy. That's not how it works. Be offended, who cares? Good for you. Yep, mini me, I couldn't agree more. They really need to grow up. Go straight on. And you guys know me. I mean I don't go out of my way to offend people with my with my thoughts, but I can guarantee you I will speak my mind and if you don't like it. Hmm? Oh well. Too flippin' bad. No, exactly. If you if you would have gone 20 years ago, if you would have gone to anybody and would say, oh, this and this offends me, people would look at you and say, yeah, good. So? We are such a... Oh, yeah. We got so whiny and so soft. It's honestly, it's amazing to me that the Taliban right didn't overrun us. And then continue yet. straight on. Go straight on. Honestly, it's 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 amazing to me that not one Middle Eastern state has overrun us. Hello, Steven. Welcome to the stream. <laughs> you, you, you joined in a very opportune time. You know what? I'm an idiot. I can't turn here. Sorry, cop. Keep right and then continue straight on. Go straight on. Ooh, buffalo wings, yummy. Enjoy them, Michael. Well, no, not everyone. I'm not saying everyone. But more and more and more. And the problem is we are raising a new generation that is going to be like, honestly, like, like Andrew Bernard said in the, in the office, the soft underbelly of my upbringing is my soft underbelly like you know this whole nonsense for example that you can't really yell at recruits anymore that started when I was a sergeant
Hey, Gomer, thank you so much. Keep right, and then turn right. Turn right. Yeah, I'm not even talking about that. That that's a whole different story. That that uh, that goes into into a whole other issue. You know what? I'm honestly I'm not talking about that right now because that is it's yeah. No, I'm I'm talking about more in general. In 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 general terms, we are raising the next generation to be so so concerned and so well almost afraid to say anything it's gonna come back to bite us big time Utah likes to see us. Yeah, see? My kids learn to stand up for what they believe in. Whether that be politically correct or not. See? Rerouting. That's the thing. I'm not raising them to be politically correct. I'm raising them to have respect. And that, I think, is the thing that's missing these days. Respect. Keep left. Thank you, Gomer. That was very kind of you. The thing is, if you raise somebody with respect, or if you show people respect, then it doesn't matter what your political orientation is. It doesn't matter what, uh, whatever else, because you are respecting each Keep other. Right and then turn right. The problem is that respect is getting almost systematically eradicated. Turn right. But I digress. Um, what do I think of Wyoming? Um, with the precursor that I have no idea how Wyoming looks in real life, I like what I see. Uh, I don't like that Crown Vic there cutting me off, but besides that, I do like what I see. Uh, currently we are not in Wyoming, we are now in Utah. I am picking up a load of dynamite, but, uh... Oh look, that's a little bit longer train. I mean, it's still short, but it's a little bit longer than just one... Uh... Oh, Gomer, I will. <laughs> For one thing, I can't afford to stop. But uh, I also don't want to stop. Pretty much. But since I won't flip the truck on its side, we don't have to worry about that. Oh, look down there, Amtrak. What do I think of New Zealand? Um, well, Stephen. I don't think anything of New Zealand because I've never been there. 
Um, Andrew, I am using uh, just the normal... Obviously, the normal track IR sensor. Right. And, and I'm using right. a wireless... Um, exit right. I'm using... Or, yeah, I'm, I'm using a uh, battery-operated... Turn left. Um, track I arc dip. Keep left. Why is that harsh? It's left. not harsh, it's honest. Yeah, exactly. It turn looks pretty left. nice in Lord of the Rings. That's all I can tell you about New Zealand. That's that's all I'm thinking of it. I don't know. I can't talk about a country that I don't know. I know, Zeno. I have no idea how I'm supposed to cover everything. But it's a good time for us simulation players, for sure, because there's one one coming out after another. Uh, the only thing that I'm a little bit sad about is that it's still limited to four employees on your online company that means i have to be very picky with whom i'm gonna who's gonna be able to come in <laughs> everything's got yeah exactly what's the name there ah leo van honestly no because at the moment it is so difficult to get parts even What I would Keep like right. to really do is right. travel from the most western part of Canada right. to the most eastern part in an RV. That would be one of my bucket list items and also travel from sea to shiny sea in the States. That uh, would be another one of these. left and then turn left turn left oh I know Paul it's ridiculous Ridiculous, and I am afraid it's not gonna get any better anytime soon. Yeah, other than that, I've been in so many countries already. Uh, I think I'm I'm good. I don't need to travel the world anymore. Go straight on. I grew up in Europe and I have seen pretty much every country of Europe at least twice, except for the UK and Portugal. Ready to turn 30 off. 80 for three grand as if turn left
Yeah, Michael. Uh, Get ready. Problem right. is that we tried making our last attempt in making a video in flashing lights was not really uh, successful. Because, um, well, you know how the game is, right? Uh, it's just at the moment, it's not the most opportune time. I don't think I've ever been down here before. This part of Utah. I can't remember this facility at all. Get ready to turn left. Turn left. Latency issues? Where do you see latency issues? It's running at a solid 60 FPS. No hiccups whatsoever. Yeah, we did. But at the moment, it's not really playable. Like, it is playable, but there's just not enough content for us to Get make a new video on it. Turn left. Oh, you meant flashing lights. Why don't you say that? Um, what's my name again? I Actually, it's funny you say that. I was thinking of uh, SnowRunner here the other day and the fact that I haven't touched this game in almost two months. Get ready to turn right. Turn right. Okay, I've never, 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 never have I been in this facility before. Turn right. I mean, holy cow. Uh, yes, Grant, this is the new LT. Some kind of... Pet, I don't know what it is. It's some kind of chemical facility. Like, obviously, it has chems in it. This is where it ends. Yeah, John, you know what my problem is? I have no idea what would be an equivalent. So, yeah, I don't know. I don't know if that would be a new drop-off or not, to be honest with you. Yeah, the inside, but have you seen the... Uh, have you seen the whole... surroundings? Like... That does not look like a copy-placed camps plant. Look at this. Yeah, this is, John, that's exactly my problem. I, I'm so, so far removed from AMD stuff. That I just don't know. I, I, I would lie if I say I know anything about radons.
No, I can with 100% guarantee tell you that I have not been in this facility ever. Yeah, well, the the main part of the plant is probably standardized. I agree, but oh, this is not gonna be nice. No, you're good. Well, Grant, I wish you best of luck for it, for sure. I'd say. I'm just curious where we're gonna deliver that dynamite to. Plus... I have to be honest. My class 1, or my my um, category run in 1-3 uh, endorsement is completely expired. I mean, I still have a TDG, but I have no no uh, TDG class one anymore. They make it. They don't need it. They produce it. Ready to roll. Yes, kinda. Well, it's a straight class one explosive. Yeah, uh, straight class one explosives. Easy peasy.
Get ready to turn left. Turn left. Look at facility though. Man, oh man, oh man. <laughs> Not really. What I can tell you though is that on a uncontrolled On an uncontrolled uh, crossing like this one with uh, dangerous goods, I have to stop before crossing. Even though those are just yield signs. It's the same with school buses for that matter. Yeah, it's too late now. Ayo! Yes, you are correct. I should have had my hazards as well. Get ready to turn right. Turn right. Uh, that's going to be a nice relaxed drive up there. Clear across Wyoming. Go straight on. The wheel with the shifter and the paddles was right around 700. Keep right, and then turn right. Turn right. Keep left, and then turn left. Well, the quality, uh, uh, well, I, I wouldn't say cheap, but it's kind of one of those cases where you pay what you, or you, you get what you pay for, right? I mean, I really liked my G29, but, uh, my, my G27, but, um, comparing G27 and this is like comparing a uh, Rolls Royce to a uh, Polsky Fiat. That's right, we're on the road again. Keep right, and then turn right. Traveling places that we've turn never right. been. Go 
good old Willy. On that note, I say I never smoked weed with Willy again. My party's all over before it begins. Pour me some old whiskey river, my friend. But I never smoke weed with Willie again. Exactly. Hey Simon, how's it going? I'm doing well, thanks for asking. Cannot complain. Yeah, I figured that that's going to be a thing. Recomputing. I A D port of entry. That is a pretty snazzy scale house. Dang, Keep son. Left. Mr. Rito, you are not wrong. Nothing 
Nice. So Paul, where are you now? I know you're not in Alaska anymore. And I also know that you're on your way to the airport, but I mean, like, state-wise, where did you move to? Sixty-five miles an hour, dangerous goods with explosive. That's your max. Dude, oh, yeah, in Seattle, fun. Hello, Steven. Yeah, you're not wrong. Oh, nice. Well, enjoy your stay. Look at that facility back there. Dang, son. How do I keep it from crashing? Ooh. It crashes every now and again. Just like everybody else. Was Keep left. Yeah, exactly. 
once I hit the 300 plus mods is usually when you can be certain you have a crash about every, oh, I don't know, two, three hours. Yeah, exactly. Especially with map mod. Oh, look, a side by side. Whoa, that is a nice train there. Yeah, basically. Yeah, but John, that would actually require some effort on whoever puts the mods or wants to put the mods in. You can't really expect that. Hey, Alec. You're welcome. How's it going? International LT. Keep right and then exit right. Exit right. Get ready to turn left. Oh, thank you, Stephen. Very kind of you. How's it going, Kai? Turn left. Or key? Key, I guess. Oh yeah, absolutely. As I said, when I was really heavily into mods and everything, I ran 300 plus mods. Keep right. Now, honestly, all I'm running anymore is usually pro mods. And, uh, pro mods, maybe one or two truck mods, a bunch of trailer mods, 
like load mods. Um, real company and uh, what's the other one called? Um, Go straight on. Long freight trains. Go straight on. Keep left and then turn left. Turn left. Uh, Steven, that depends. It depends what other mods you are running and in what order you're running. That's kind of what we were talking here about the last 15 minutes. Yeah, I know, right? Casper and Lander. Yeah, you're not kidding. You are not kidding. Go straight on. Yeah, it happens, unfortunately. Why well, you can, but not without being a map modder that actually knows what they're doing. See, that drives me sometimes insane. And then, what, like, when you turn this off, you can actually hear on that last turn when the fan belt slips a little bit. That's where they have a crazy amount of detail in their sounds. And then when you turn the engine on and drive, it's just land. Well, hi there. Like, listen to this. And 
Turn it off. So annoying. Yeah, I can't really disagree with that. Yeah, it does look a little bit like Cascadia. I agree. The thing is, let's be honest, it doesn't matter if Cascadia, Volvo, uh, Peterbilt, Penworth, once you get into this class of truck, where you have these super efficient forms and shapes and, and CV conscientious uh, designs, they all look the same. They lose totally their individuality. Keep left. been live for roughly roughly one hour 56 minutes and 33 seconds round about Oh yeah, 100%. Go straight on. So even though Keep it is right 12 right away. Continue straight on. Go straight on. When it comes to... Well, it depends now. Are we talking about creature comfort? Or are we talking about just looks? Or are we talking about engine performance? Or what are we talking about? Because every category has their own... In my book, anyway, has their own winners.
Volvos are beautiful trucks. I mean, I used to drive... I used to drive a VNL. One of the most comfortable trucks I ever drove. Morning Zingus. Keep left and then turn left. Turn left. Yeah, yeah, I'm turning. I like Peterbilt's too, although I have to say, of all the trucks that I ever driven, my favorite one was uh, Freightliner 09 Classic. That was my all-time favorite. I loved, 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 loved that truck. Go straight on. Good night, Eric. Well, thanks for watching. Uh-oh. Well, Tyler, I have two for sale. You want Keep one right. for yourself. No. Keep left and then turn left. Well, Simon, I'd like turn to see left. you drive after hmm, how many years? It was actually the first time in 12, almost 13 years that I was driving more than just in a yard. Uh. To be fair, that truck that I was driving today, boy oh boy, it has some major issues still. Like I was halfway, halfway between, uh, bet 
between the gas station and the yard and all of a sudden she started to smoke bright white so uh, uh, bright blue not white blue so that tells me that the rings are most likely gone Problem is, I already, I don't even know how many, uh, how many hours, how many man hours we put into that rebuild already. So if that engine has now uh, problems on top of all that, then yeah, it's get to the point where we have to cut our losses, and she's probably going for auction. Um, very, very, very rarely, because by the time I get off work, they are long done uh, recording. Which is why you haven't seen me in any videos for the last, well, probably now getting close to three months. And probably won't see me in any videos with everybody for, who knows. What's my name again? How long have you been a mechanic? And before you answer, just so you know, I'm a shop foreman. Essentially, it's a shop for men. How's it going? Long time. Yeah, the thing the thing that I don't know is now with those new ones, I never really worked on DEF engines. BTT, if you want to, you can now. And you have to keep in mind that on a diesel engine, um, the fuel is oil. Like, there is a reason it's called diesel oil. Oh, yeah, sorry to hear that. How are you feeling though? Uh, John, I am driving the international LT until I can afford something else. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh yeah. Well, that's good. The interior is nice. The interior is definitely nice. Um, good night, Paul. Safe travels, buddy. I'll see you in three months. All of them. When they asked me, Alex, how many DLCs do you want? I said yes. A little. That's the understatement of the year. Yeah, exactly. Exit right. Oh, that's unfortunate. I won't be able to go to the scale. Oh, oh no! Actually, <laughs> I was lying. Turn right. I have to go to the scale. a new route yeah yeah I know keep right well since we Turn don't right. have all states and or Canada yet so far I think my favorite is hmm Colorado I think if I would have to pick a favorite, but I hate favorites. See you, Levi. Have a good one. John, I have the feeling that's going to be a long time. Keep left and then turn left.
Turn left. Lower, probably retired by that time. Oh my, look at that. With a Jeep. Yeah, there's a Pro Mods version, but it only has Van uh, it only has BC, and only a small part of BC at that. But you know what? I have no problem waiting. Because if you look at the quality and how the quality of all the DLCs is continually going a step up, a step up, a step up. Yeah, I'm okay with waiting. For sure. I know it's all over now. See, they really need the dynamite here at the mine. Actually, I was hauling for RBS. I was hauling. Uh, um, I was hauling explosives to a gold mine in BC. That's nice. Thank you, loader up. Yeah, tomorrow we're gonna be hauling a long haul. And then for uh, Sunday, I think we're gonna go back to bus. And then Monday, Labor Day, I don't know yet, we'll see. Uh, the next state is going to be Texas.
forward. When we hold explosives? No. Those are really, really un... Uh, like, you would... Except for, obviously, the, the explosive placard. You wouldn't be able that there's anything else uh, on there. Because you don't want everybody to realize what's been hauled. It depends also on the explosive, John. Keep that in mind. There's so many different forms of explosives. And the stuff that we hauled really wasn't classified as explosives until you mix it with diesel. Up until then it was just chemicals. know your chemistry then you know what I hauled oh, come on what the No, they are not great, to be honest. But then again, keep in mind, I only have 24-inch uh, monitors. So the mirrors are always tiny, tiny, tiny for me to use. Well, ladies and gentlemen, as much fun, as much fun as this was, um, it is after midnight, so the stream is coming now to an end. I hope you enjoyed it. I will be back tomorrow with more streaming goodness. Until then, this is Alex signing off. Thanks for watching. God bless.